Hello everybody, this is XX Jumps here's XX here again. Um sorry for all this mess on my PC and this whatever this creepy face was. Yeah. Sorry about that. Um and also sorry for the mess on the computer. I was working on the I wanna be the bushy stage in Arabic Square. Yes. So sorry about that. I'm gonna to have to clean this up right after this video along with this. And this yep, this is meant to be my upcoming work in progress is Blue Yoshi. So yeah. Um today I'm gonna to show you how to um get my characters working on any one point one screen pack. So apparently Let's just say you're trying out my character. By the way, I'm using Gaming Moon and 1.1 screen pack. Just as you're pertaining, if you're trying out my character, then you put in a characters folder. I don't know what, why that's here. Alright, so... Let's, so let's just say you go in... Here. And you see a missing portrait. And then, you see, you can't see the, my sprite, because it's invincible. I always use Paint 3D. So, here's how to um, actually fix it. Um, you have to go to Mugen Configure. That's the notepad. Now you need to scroll down. And find it, the video. You need to change the um, render me render uh, I meant render mode sorry um to open G L then you need to save and you must go back to your game yep there's the portrait. Now that you can see my character, um, so that's how you can actually get my characters working in some of others of 1.1 Mugen screen packs, you see. So, now you see that, um, you can actually get my characters working, as the video told you, that I actually teach you, so... This was a little quick video, so I hope you enjoyed, I'll actually make more videos or even characters somehow, like, soon, so, see ya.